Dirty and Nasty Plays in Football. Football, it's a game of skill, strategy, and sometimes controversy. Welcome to our deep dive into some of the dirtiest and nastiest plays in football history. Remember, we don't endorse unsporting behavior, but we believe in learning from the past. When emotions run high and stakes are even higher, players can cross the line. Let's start with the infamous Bounty Gate scandal involving the New Orleans Saints in 2009 to 2011. This pay-for-pain incentive system led to an unprecedented level of brutality on the field. The next name on our list is Ndamukong Su, known for his aggressive style and multiple on-field incidents. His infamous stomp on Evan Dietrich Smith during a 2011 Thanksgiving Day game shocked fans and cost him a two-game suspension. Bill Romanowski, a linebacker known for his intensity, often crossed the line. His most notorious moment came in a 1997 game when he spat in the face of receiver J.J. Stokes, igniting a fierce debate about sportsmanship. Albert Hainsworth, a former Tennessee Titan, was part of one of the NFL's darkest moments. His 2006 stomp on Andre Garode's unprotected face resulting in 30 stitches earned him a five-game suspension, the longest for on-field misconduct at that time. Vontaz Burfik's career has been marred by controversy due to his aggressive and often dangerous plays. One notable incident was his headshot on Antonio Brown during a 2016 playoff game, which resulted in a three-game suspension. These examples serve as stark reminders of what can happen when competitive spirit oversteps the boundaries of fair play. We hope the lessons learned from these incidents continue to shape a safer and more respectful future for football. If you found this video intriguing, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and subscribe for more content that delves into the fascinating, sometimes shocking aspects of sports. Until next time, remember, respect the game, respect the players.